how augmented reality works. So before we get started, make sure to hit that like button and also subscribe my channel. How does augmented reality work? Augmented reality works by analyzing the environment and using triggers around you to display relevant information in the applicable place in your field of view. So for example, an AR function for a map application might be programmed to detect the logos of specific stores and display details such as store hours when you look at them. On a smartphone, that's simply a case of putting the information on the screen. But for a wearable AR headset like Magic Leap, the process is even more immersive. By using information from the built-in eye tracker, virtual content is rendered correctly and slightly differently for each eye which enables virtual objects to appear at any depth. There are several factors in the design of Magic Leap that influence how you experience this process. Designed for comfort and long-term use. Enterprise class, head-mounted displays must be designed in a way that lets the user wear them for longer periods of time without causing fatigue or strain. Because the device must fit securely and perform well, Magic Leap did the work to measure performance and comfort on a diverse range of users. Researchers at Magic Leap spent years capturing 3D scans of hundreds of heads and have seen a wide range of head shapes, sizes, distances between nose bridges and eyes, all to inform the industrial design of the platform. Numerous pad configurations for forehead and nose make Magic Leap comfortable for all head shapes and sizes. Magic Leap devices are fully customizable, distribute weight evenly around the head, and are designed for thermal comfort. You can even insert prescription lenses in your device to make it even more customized. Designed for human physiology Magic Leap has a unique heritage of designing for the human body thanks to the founding team's groundbreaking work in the biomedical industry. This experience has uniquely inspired Magic Leap to create a device that operates harmoniously with human physiology. Magic Leap works in tandem with our natural visual system in a safe and effective way. To create incredibly real experiences. Magic Leap's operating range begins at 37 centimeters, well within an arm's length, and is among the largest operating ranges in the industry. Accordingly, Magic Leap has designed its AR wearable devices to deliver experiences that are low friction and do not typically induce nausea. How is augmented reality used? By bridging the divide between the digital and physical worlds, and combining them in a unique first-person point of view, AR has the potential to revolutionize many different professional fields, not just personal entertainment. The use of augmented reality in medicine and surgery. Augmented reality is already being used in cutting-edge medical scenarios. In October 2020, surgeons at UC Davis Children's Hospital in Sacramento, K, use Magic Leap technology to prepare for the separation of twin babies who were joined at the head. This rare and intricate surgery was planned by building a 3D reconstruction of the conjoined twins from MRI and CT scans, which were then viewed on the Magic Leap platform using BrainLab's mixed reality viewer software. The surgical team was then able to walk around the models to view all possible angles before a single incision was made. Sentiarm software, for example, connects operating physicians to 3D patient cardiac data in real time, helping guide them during the procedure. It also helps patients visualize and understand the procedures they are about to undergo. SyncThink, Incorporated is another company working with Magic Leap on clinical trials to explore AR for vestibular disorders like concussions. Hiru, Incorporated, on the other hand, is using AR to innovate diagnostic solutions in optometry. The Companime's platform on the Magic Leap 2 headset is designed to replace several legacy diagnostic devices and includes planned applications related to personalized vision correction that would allow clinicians to diagnose and manage patients with increased efficiency. There are everyday practical applications as well, allowing doctors to view patient notes remotely or collaborate with colleagues on patient cases in different cities or even countries. Indoor and Outdoor Navigation Augmented reality navigation perfectly works both outdoor or indoor. In the first case, AR navigation systems work as virtual guides and show information about real objects while hovering a smartphone on a certain object, as well as direct you along the route. Isn't it that cool? Also, 
AR Guide can lead you inside large buildings, such as shopping malls or airports. Besides, for owners of commercial buildings, such applications are another available advertising space. Moreover, augmented reality navigation can perfectly work even in an apartment or house. Using AR, you can give guests a full 3D home tour with the press of a button. The use of augmented reality in manufacturing. Linear Motion Company, PBC Linear, is one of the many organizations using AR to capture and leverage machine instructions from seasoned employees and train new machine operators, resulting in an 80% reduction in training time and 20% in annual savings due to less scrap and fewer mistakes, ensuring quality parts get to customers on time. Thanks to an AR package called Manifest, created by Tactile and running on the Magic Leap platform, PBC Linear Frontline workers have instant access to step-by-step -step guidance from their most experienced technicians and trainers anytime and anywhere. AR is helping train and upskill the PBC Linear workforce, regardless of geographic location. The use of augmented reality in events and marketing Created to work in both physical and virtual shared spaces, the potential uses for augmented reality are limited only by ambition and imagination. Magic Leap is used by enterprise platforms such as Cavernous, which collaborated with events agency Fix8 Group to produce a hybrid model for experiential brand marketing in which in-person attendees and those joining via AR were able to communicate, collaborate, and even influence the lighting and music. Magic Leap is also used by Tailspin, an immersive learning platform that uses AR to deliver corporate skills training, and by Medata Storytelling Ya Company, Flow Immersive, which transforms complex information into easily understood AR visualizations that are shareable on social media. How does AR display digital content? For each augmented reality experience, we need to define some logic beforehand. This specifies which digital content to trigger when something is recognized. In the live AR system, upon recognition, the rendering module displays the relevant content onto the camera feed, the last step in the AR pipeline. Making this fast and realistic is very challenging, particularly for wearable displays like glasses, another very active area of research. Another way to explain how AR works is to consider computer vision as inverse rendering. Intuitively, computer vision recognizes and understands the 3D world from a 2D image. There is a face and where it is in the 3D world, so that we can add digital content, a 3D giraffe mask anchored to the face, that is then rendered onto the 2D phone screen. R is a very active field, and in the future we expect to see many exciting new developments. As computer vision gets better at understanding the world around us, AR experiences will become more immersive and exciting. Moreover, augmented reality today lives mostly on smartphones, but it can happen on any device with a camera. When enough computational power will be available on AR glasses, we expect this medium to make AR mainstream, enhancing the way we live, work, shop, and play. What is the future of augmented reality? A March 2021 study by Statista estimated there will be 2.4 billion mobile AR users worldwide by 2023. Ownership of dedicated AR devices such as Magic Leap is expected to reach 30 million units by 2023, an increase of over 380% from 2020. Increased use of AR platforms is one thing, but as the saying goes, you should follow the money for the full story. Spending on more extended reality of technology for just the U.S. construction and manufacturing sectors is projected to hit $35 billion in the next two years. Visualization of the Future Result The main function of augmented reality is to intertwine with the real environment and add virtual but lifelike elements. It is very effective for demonstrating future results in construction, interior design, retail, or medicine. Thus, you can give home buyers the ability to see how their future house will look like, how a new sofa will look in your room, or see what your smile will look like after a visit to the dentist. Augmented reality makes it all possible. What do you think about our video? Let me know in the comment section below. If you enjoyed this video, make sure hit that like button. Also subscribe our channel before you go.
Thank you for watching video.